Hey everyone, Karant here welcoming you back to Citizens of Earth. Last time we found the moon bucks and began exploring it at last, and this time we are on the second level of the moon bucks with our new, very uh, lit party member, shall we say, uh, Corona. Alright, so as we explore these kind of narrow hallways, let's Go. kill things. Keep it up. And Corona leveled up to level 25 after killing the first cactus, so hey, there you go. We got ourselves a nice little extra prize there, and I think we're going to be getting levels for the other two fairly soon, but I don't know. We'll see. Alright, so I went ahead and pretty much killed everything in the very immediate area, so we could walk around for a smidge. Uh, as usual, we can't pull up a map of the region, unfortunately, but it looks like, let's see... So we've got some of the original kind of moonbuck structure, and then we've got all this land here. Let's kill Charge. these calves. Eureka. And Marie Curie hit level 33 while we were killing said cactuses. So yeah, like I said, the levels are coming pretty hot and heavy, but then again, that's to be expected given that this is most likely the end of the game, so there you go. Alright, so let's see what we have in Yon Treasure here. We have... Ah, Cola. Okay, not bad. And it looks like this is the periphery, it would appear. So we've got a little bit more room to move around, so to speak. Although, yeah, snakes. Well, that's what I get for thinking I can just squeeze past those guys. Uh, okay, let's see if I can coerce you over here. And then we can use this rock to uh, dodge right on around. There we go. Okay. Anything else of note over this way? I'm kind of thinking this is probably going to be the way forward moving through here, so maybe I should be a little more exploratory of the avenues down this way. I definitely want to explore all of it, though, if I can. Go! For a celebration. And Corona's talent hit level 3, so now we can speed up and slow down time. Was I aware we could do that? Uh, let's see. There you are, Corona. We have... This ball of light has the power to alter the flow of time. Okay, thanks, weird narrator person. So, what does that even entail? Uh, let's time at 2.5. Oh dear god, we move fast. Oh, holy cow. Okay, so I'm keeping this battle up because I don't have enough time to take it out of circulation, but dear heavens! Another victory for the VP! Wow, so it looks like the close of things will. Holy cow. Okay, so, man, uh, super speed here. Good luck. Goodness gracious. And I guess I'll just keep the battles up because they're going to end way too fast for me to cut them, like I said. Ha! <laughs> well, this will definitely help if I decide to grind all my characters up to level 30, which gives you one of the game's achievements, essentially. Okay, so anyway, so that I can actually cut these battles out this and ball. such. Yes, yes, thank you very much. Let's... Oh, God, let me... Okay, let's look on the other end of this. 0. 0.25. <laughs> oh, my gosh, look at this. Okay. Oh, my God, it even affects the speed of the menus and everything. Yeah, let's... Uh, this ball of... Let's, let's put this back to normal. <laughs> Oh my goodness. But yeah, I could definitely see how this would make grinding a lot easier when it comes to such things. Alright, anyway, let's kill you. And we went ahead and killed its friend up here while we were at it. Let's see. No, no treasure there. We've got ourselves another sort of conduit to a regular walkway, and we've got all you guys converging, so... Uh, can I get around you? Yes, I can. Yay, okay. Uh, but not around you. Well done, team. And then Corona hit level 26 as a result of that battle. So, yeah. Wow. For Now, granted, we fed Corona one of those brain foods, so that definitely helped. But those levels are coming pretty fast, especially since we've got a team that's very effective against what we're fighting here. That, of course, makes things rather nice. All right. So, let's see. Okay, so we've got a treasure up here. Alright, I will gladly take a birthday cake. And now we gotta deal with these guys over... Let's see if I can... 
either avoid you or try to get some of you guys together so we can fight you a little easier, or a little faster at least. Uh, let's get you guys. And then we can wander down here where I've already seen you, you two. calls for a celebration now I can say and Baywatch hit level 35 as a result of all those cacti so hey I like those HP gains I like well all the gains really all right so let's see all right, so I see you over there I see you guys here let's kill y'all and then we can see if there's anything worthy of our attention up this way okay so it looks like you're just any treasure? No, so we can just avoid you. Okay, so it looks like this is the right way to go, I suppose. Mm -hmm. You think there's anyone here? Well, us, of course. Mm -hmm. do, do you think there's anyone else down here? Don't worry, we'll be safe. <laughs> you should. You should worry. Oh, you talk. Your safety is, uh, how you say, not guaranteed. Hello, hey, dear. It's our robot friends. Boy, am I glad to see you guys. I'm gonna be honest, I thought it was just one robot doing all the dressing up, but it looks like it's actually multiples. Uh-oh. -uh. I don't think they want to be our friends. Well, not with that attitude, they won't. Watch me win them over with my smile. I don't think that's gonna work there, buddy. Me say we killed this chowder head, Mon, before he hit with that smile attack. Mon. I'm not sure what you said, but I hope it involved killing them before they reach the portal. Portal? Why? What are you hiding in there? That's for us to know and for you to die before you find out. Oh, great. We already kicked your robots once. What makes you think you stand a chance this time? You had to go and ask, Still didn't you? We are indomitable. <laughs> I don't quite think that's how it goes there, buddy, but sure. Well, lucky for us, I don't know what that word means. <laughs> so the All VP's right. ignorance Here leads him go. on. Okay, so... Oh, dear. Uh, we're going to trade the party out for a second. Yes, because I want to get in somebody else who can do some lightning stuff. Because we've already got the chemist, that's good. Let's see, who else can do... Well, hmm. I might just put in another healer. Let's see... Or I could just go ahead and put Conspiracy Guy in yeah. and just ham it up. Hehe. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Alright, so you've got your verbal, of course, that you can use normally. And we've also got the static here. Okay, so let's see. Alright, so nothing you're really going to be able to change to is going to help. But, let's go ahead and... Go ahead and start giving the buffs. Okay, yeah, let's go ahead and give you a buff here. Okay, so... Oh, that doesn't work if you don't have light. Or if you're not already lit up, I guess. Alright, so... Yeah, let's go ahead and keep on with the static attacks. Because, my god, they're doing pretty well. And then for you... Ah, oh, let's see. Okay, so... I guess we can go ahead and do the strong physical attacks. We can start playing with these. See what they do here. Yeah. Uh, not bad. Not bad. Like that, huh? Of course, Conspiracy Guy's doing more damage than anything else. You can tell by the way he uses his walk that he's staying alive. Oh my gosh. Ah, uh, this game. I will say, one of the things that... I wouldn't really particularly say that I don't like about the game, but one of the things that I sort of regret about this game is... That flavor text that you're seeing in those boxes there, you barely see it all that long at all, which is really unfortunate because it's some pretty interesting flavor text. Alright, so let's go ahead and see if we can continue this. Don't ever expect this. <coughs> yeah. Excuse me. And we did it. Nice. So that'll get no levels actually, but it will get us a document shredder for the secretary. It's about dang time. And wow, we really Oh, there we go. Did not want us going into this portal. Hmm. I wonder who they work for. Whoever it is, they might be right inside. Ooh, this is so exciting. Uh-huh. It might be super deadly inside. Want me to go in first? No, no, as your leader, it should be me. And if something happens, make sure my funeral's classy. Ice sculptures, fancy soaps, hire a magician. Okay, if you say so. 
And we get an achievement with their powers combined, which I'm not entirely sure what that did, but probably, well, it didn't give us a level. Okay, so what did that challenge just do? Let's see. Where is it? With their Ah, okay, so it's a story. It's story-based, okay. Alright, so... Let's see. Well, now the conspiracy guy has done his thing. Let's... I want to get somebody into the party that doesn't really have much experience yet. We haven't used yeah. her very much. And that is our farmer. Actually, do we need to use our farmer? Who have I used even less? I haven't used the beekeeper at all, have I? Uh... Hey, honey. I don't remember. Let's see. Well, oh gosh, you're almost dead, so you're out. Uh, I haven't used the pharmacist. Let's use the pharmacist. Yeah. Let's get him some levels toward the end of the game. And let's also see what is in this portal. Okay, we are still on the moon bucks. Interesting. Okay. Seems like we have no enemies around here, though, at least not in the immediate area. So, I guess we can take our time and explore a little bit? And when I say a little bit, I apparently mean a lot, because this seems to be a very big area. Okay, uh, well, treasure, hi. Alright, I'll take a dragon roll. I... okay, we can't examine that. But yeah, it looks like we don't have any enemies here, but we do have a portal there, so I'll have to remember that. Okay, so yeah, looks like no enemies around here. We'll just run around and collect treasure, because why not? Capitalism at its and we still can't examine the things, so oh well. That's too bad. I was kind of hoping to get the pharmacist some levels while we were here, but I may just have to feed him a brain food. Okay, so... Let's see, was that a... Okay, sorry, I thought I saw a treasure box up there, but I didn't. Alright, what is... Let's see what is down this away. Again, hoping for treasure, because treasure is always good. Uh, another weird machine, and nothing there, so... Kind of keep on looking around. And... Okay, was this where we started out to begin with? Yeah, this is where we were, were to begin with, so... Okay, we swung back around over there. Anything up here? Okay, yeah, there we go. Capitalism Thank you, I will take coffee. Well, I assume breathe is coffee. I'm not entirely sure, honestly. Then, let's make sure I'm not missing any extra... Okay, I don't think I'm missing any other paths, because that was pretty straightforward over there. So let's go back over this way, and... see what awaits us in the portal over here, because it looks like that's where we need to go next, I would expect... Oh, treasure, hi. Okay, so apparently I actually had not found all the treasure in here, so good thing I kept looking. Alright, anything else? Anything else? Anything else? Nope. Okay, so... I guess, in that case then, now that we've found all the treasure, all roads lead to this... Well, a little more sophisticated looking portal, so let's see what awaits us here. What? What is this happening? Someone pinch me! Ouch! It's just an expression! Uh -uh. I don't think we're imagining this, sir. You sound unhappy! No, no unhappy! We don't like unhappy! Hmm. What's the plan, sir? The plan! The plan! Hey, what plan? No time for plans. Come see your commander! Yes, the commander! Ah, uh, good. Someone in charge. I should warn you, as vice president, I outrank this commander of yours. Oh, he's so impressive. Can we touch him? Oh, yes, we should touch him. N no, no, we should not touch him. Okay, even better. Yay. Now, come with us. The commander is displeased at our past interactions with your leaders. No! Mm -hmm. What'd you do this time? Hmm. Have you dealt with these things before? We need to preserve the happy. Yes, the happy! Come with us. Nothing about any of this is making me happy. Oh. I doubt we have a choice here. Oh, well, we're going to be automatically going along here. Darn it. I was kind of hoping this would be a good time for us to save, but I guess not yet. That's all right. I had to cut a few battles out anyway, so we can go for a little longer. Once we get freedom of movement, I think we're going to end the episode for today. 
Also, I could see this going so terribly badly in the end. I'm a little odd. What's all this? What do you mean? Wait, so you guys created all the weird animals that have been showing up. You betcha! Happy! <laughs> Happy? These things are violent and wild and smelly. And some of them are made out of honey. I mean, come on, honey. We don't understand. We made these to your exact specification. Does he not want them now? No, no, he does not want them now. Why do politicians lie to us? Our lies must make them happy. Happy! Yay, happy! Ah! Well, we do sort of have a pool going round. Whoever gets away with the biggest lie wins. The pot's pretty big this year, actually. We don't like lies. Lies make us happy. Hmm. Did you promise these creatures something? I make it a point never to promise anything to non-voters. It cheapens the whole lying process. Mm -hmm. So you have no clue what they're talking about, huh? Oh, hey, look, we're flying over Earth. At least I presume that's Earth. All right, and on we continue to march. I kind of get the feeling we're going to be going back through all this later. Just my thought. Also, who is the mysterious commander of the alien ship? Commander, commander, we brought you the Earthlings! Oh, you're surprisingly normally alien. The short one is their vice elephant. Yay, vice elephant! Vice elephant, good lord. That's vice president. And I'm actually perfect average height for my IQ, so whatever. Greetings. I am the commander. Oh, hi there, very lovely voiced commander. Oh. Their commander seems pretty happy as well. Of course the commander is happy. By what other criteria would one select a commander? Happy! Hair. For me, the criteria is definitely hair. You humans have been sowing unhappiness in my people for too long. You lie, you cheat, you steal. You have been obnoxious neighbors. Mm. This isn't making sense to me. I'm pretty sure whatever's going on, it wasn't me for once. Your entire world is to blame. We were promised happiness and it was not delivered. How are we supposed to go home now? You want happiness? Yet you unleashed monsters on the world. And a flying moon box. You might not understand this, but monsters actually don't make humans happy. Exactly, Earthling. R right. So, uh, we're done here then? And you'll leave our planet alone? You lied to us. You told us we'd be bringing happiness to your people. Hey, my friend Circles just called. He asked you to stop talking in him. Yeah. For your crimes, Earthlings. You will come with us to our home world and stand trial in the torture chamber of eternal joy. Okay. Sure, whatever you say. What? I want my attorney. Wispigle, place them in our most enjoyable holding cell. Happily, Commander! Yay! Do we at least get a phone call? And off we go again, I guess? What do we gain by locking them up? I agree. This isn't at all what we intended. <sighs> Have we recovered all our equipment from this planet yet? Not yet, but we hope to find the rest of it eventually! This keeps up. How are we supposed to survive, let alone return home? Oh dear, so now we're in prison. Uh-oh. We just can't catch a break. I'd say that was one of our more diplomatically successful missions. Well, I mean, we aren't dead, that's true. Huh? They imprisoned us! True, but we had a whole conversation that didn't end in a battle. I'd say we're getting the hang of this. You know, he kind of has a point there. Hmm. So, why do they make such horrible creatures? There's some connection between monsters and happiness. And monsters. Hmm. Did they think monsters would make us happy? All I know is we're headed to their home world to stand trial for something that most likely wasn't our fault. And you don't recall lying to them or making promises, right? I keep track of everyone I lie to in a little black book, and there's no aliens in it. <sighs> this situation is making me very unhappy. Uh-oh. Huh? What the? Are we... are we free to go? 
Hmm. There's a happiness meter on the wall and it's pointing to E. They're not just obsessed with happiness. Their technology is powered by it. Oh. Happiness is an energy source? Well, I mean, they did do it in Monsters, Inc., so there you go, I guess. Hmm. Is that why they can't get home? They're out of fuel? I say we get the heck out of here and let them worry about their fuel tanks. And let's try not to get unnecessarily happy, just in case. Chapter 6. Alright, so we've started Chapter 6 on the alien mothership and our quest is to escape from jail. Which means we've... Eh, okay. So we have, uh, all citizens on deck, uh oh. Hmm. Alright, so anyway, uh, looks like we have ourselves a new agenda, and I am going to save my game because it's time to go. So next time on Citizens of Earth, it looks like it, we're going to uh, do a jailbreak, although jail's already been broken for us, so there you go, I guess. Anyway, thank you guys for joining me, and I will see y'all later.